Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, my name is Miss Tamika. I upload videos once a week and I also throw in a bonus video throughout the week. If you want to see my new bag, how everything fits in here, how it looks on the body and things like that, then please keep watching. I just got finished doing a unboxing on this particular bag and y'all already know when I do my unboxings, my second video normally would be my second video is usually the what fits in here how it looks on the bodies and body and things like that because i figure i didn't want to connect it to the unboxing because i didn't want to make the video super long i split the video up videos up in two if you follow me here on my channel you know lately i've been you know buying dipping and dabbing and coach a little more than normal because of the fact that i used to shop at henry bindle and since henry bindle has closed down like i said i've been at coach a lot it's kind of like henry bindle where a lot of stuff go on sale you get good quality bags for half the price like i said in the unboxing this bag here was on sale at macy's.com not sure if it's still on sale but um, if it is, I'll leave it down in the um, description box. I'll leave the link for this particular bag. So if you decide to want it, you can go ahead and purchase it while it's on sale. And if for whatever reason you don't like it or whatever, you can go ahead and return it. You want to go ahead and try and purchase it, you know, while it's on sale. Because if not, this bag here retails for $3.95 with taxes a little over $400. Before the sale, to me, in my opinion, it's still worth the $3.95 because it's all leather. And it's that good leather. Like you can smell the smell the leather on the bag, and like I said here, you have your snake skin um, detailing right here. And I think I'm gonna go and grab my Louis Vuitton. Um, what is it? Like the scarf thing from Louis Vuitton, just to see how it would look on here. I don't think it would match for its color, but I just want to see if I wrap it around this strap. How will it look? So once I um grab that i'll be right back okay i tilt the camera down so y'all can focus on the beautiful bag so i just wanted to see how this will work not that i will use this particular color and i probably would get one from coach because i think the one from coach is a lot shorter but i just wanted to see how this would look for the sake of this video because like i said this one here is long Cause I see a lot of people wrap their little toolies or scarves or whatever you want to call them like around the bag. I'm not sure if I did that right, but and again, I'm not going to keep this on here. I just wanted to see how it would look wrapped on this on this particular bag. Cause like I said, I see a lot of people, you know, wrapping the straps. I probably would have to fix it a little more, but it looks cute though. Like I can see why people put their little toolies or scarves or whatever on the handle part. Said if I do decide to do that, I will go to the coach outlet and try and find one that's, you know, not that expensive because I don't want to pay full price for it because it's just to decorate my bag. Go ahead and pull out my Gucci wallet because I had purchased this, I think I purchased this a few years ago. I think this was one of my birthday gifts. So I haven't wore it, worn this in a while, but for the sake of the video, I was gonna use this instead of my coach wallet. And I have the coach papers in here. So it's nothing in here as of now, but if I do decide to use it, I'll go ahead and transfer my stuff over here, over in here. So I'm gonna go ahead and open this. And y'all, I love this gun metal with against this blue really quick at the uh in the unboxing i had saw something on the corners but i just rubbed it and it came off i like my stuff to be perfect if i can help it you know especially when you're paying your money for stuff but i just want to show you you have your front pocket here you have this middle pocket and it also has a pouch here then you also have a zipper right here then you have this back area right here so you have three slots here and then you also have this back pocket which can fit your cell phone and for reference and for reference I have the iPhone 10 that it fits 
nicely in here and this is probably where I would keep my iPhone because I'm always grabbing my iPhone or, or always using it so I was like with it being back here it would be against me whereas I can just grab it easily without me having to go in the inside of the bag I have my pink long shot bag here and I'm going to go ahead and just grab some stuff out of here to place in here just to show y'all how things look now most of this stuff is stuff that i always show in my what's in my bag videos but like i said i'm sure y'all don't mind because it's going into another bag i'll place my wallet in the middle part and of course you know i would need my blotterazzi so i would place my blotterazzi here in the middle part where the wallet let's at. see what else so I have a lot of my stuff here in my little cosmetic pouch. So of course that can't fit. So I just grab like this impression impressions mirror. And I probably will put that here in the front. So I will use my hand sanitizer. I'll place this here in the middle compartment. And my gum. And I got some lotion from what is it called? Bath and Bodies, Body Works, lip balm, another lip balm, Dose of Color lip gloss, a pen. So it's getting a little heavy. Let's see what else. Now I always like to carry my sunglasses. So I don't know how that's going to work because the bag is a lot thinner. And I have my card case, my lipstick. So I'm going to go ahead and put this stuff right here. And I have my, uh, let me... So this is the wallet I was carrying. So this is the one I think I want to switch out of and carry my Gucci. Because like I said, I haven't carried that Gucci in a while. And I'm going to go ahead and probably put this inside of the backpack that it goes with. So, you know, it can just stay together. So, of course, that's not going to go in there. But I just wanted to show you the wallet that I was using. I have my card case. And I have my picture of my daughter and I when we went on our cruise this year. So I'm going to place that in the back area. Pack of snacks put that in the back as well then I have one of my fancier pins I'll put that back there with my card case so it's starting to fill up then I have my um, Tom's Barbie lipstick I have my Tom Ford lip gloss I need all these lip products but like I said I'm just doing this for the sake of the video now, the only thing is my glasses may not fit what I probably will have to do is uh, put these in my car like in that little sunglass pouch thing inside of my car or place these in like one of those cloths with the um, drawstring because this of course this case is too bulky but with my glasses I don't like to place them in my bag just like this because of course you know they can get scraped or scratched or whatever so I do not like to carry my glasses without them being in some kind of case so like I said I may have to find one of my little small pouches there's everything in the bag so as you can see it do close i will go ahead and place it show you a few shots don't mind the pants because y'all know i'm filming y'all don't see my bottom but i just didn't feel like changing but saying here is the bag on the side of me and it hangs really nice like it's not too low and it's not too high i have it on the one two three four it came on the fourth um so yeah and then you have this little um little thing here where it will hold the strap together because i don't like when the strap is like this so i like the fact that you have this to make sure your strap stays in place you can see the bag looks nice on the body and like I said, I, this is a color that I would never have gravitated to, but as of now, it's looking really cute. It looks like a color that would look nice with anything. Like I said, with the winter months coming, it's gonna really look good with, you know, against my jeans and things like that. Say if you wanna carry it as a um, shoulder bag, you can. And of course, I will probably shorten the strap so it can kind of go up here, but I don't think I will probably carry it like that on my shirt on my shoulder time the bag here i gotta stand on my tippy toes so y'all can see 
So I will probably try and insert some modeling shots just so y'all can really, you know, get a good shot of the bag. And also with this bag too, I may look into is one of those gold straps, those gold chains. Because they're not really that expensive from um, the coach uh, website or the coach store. And the gunmetal uh, chain because they had the gunmetal on that bag that I wanted. So I was like with that I could probably use that gunmetal with this and use this as a short you know shoulder type of bag like you know if you wanted to kind of switch it up guys this bag here is so beautiful now I'm gonna go ahead and show you uh, what's in the inside so here is everything in the inside this is not everything that I'm going to carry. I'm probably going to go ahead and with this particular bag, I am going to have to go around and mess with everything and make sure I carry everything that I need. Because with this bag I had here, I was able to put everything that I needed in here. So with this one, with this bag, I am going to have to, you know, go through everything, make sure I put everything that I need in here. Because like I said, I was carrying this and this here had held most of my stuff and i also had my hand sanitizer and stuff so instead of me taking two hand sanitizers i was only able to grab one like i said i would definitely need a wallet so of course i put my gucci because i didn't want now i did see somebody put a emily wallet in here i do have my emily wallet and my my louis vuitton emily wallet but i don't really want to pull that long wallet out because it's too big so i could put it here in the front because that's where they had it at in the front but there's no need for that big wallet like i said the gucci one fits perfect in here go to the coach outlet and see a you know cute wallet that matches this bag i may you know go and purchase it there to be if i go to the outlet because i'm not paying you know a hundred and seven dollars for a wallet i'm also looking to purchase like a cute bag charm and i'm gonna go to the outlets for that because you know the outlets have you know stuff that's cute that's not full price so i'm um, soon i'll probably look for what is this called a toolie scarf or whatever and also a little bag charm to like i said put on the side let me see if i put this here on the side how would that look because i saw one that i really liked that had the blue in there it was so cute but it was sold out so let me close it and show you so see how it just added like that little oomph to the bag i wouldn't carry this particular one but yeah so that's why like i said i was looking to find some kind of cute charm so yeah and then also i'm looking to seeing if i can get my initials on it because i am going to go ahead and keep the bag I, think I will be returning it because like i said i got it at a good price because i'm not sure how long that sale is going to be on on the macy's dot com website and just to see this bag go back to full price and then i end up loving it i would just be sick so i'm like okay this like i said it wasn't the color that i wanted but for the price i'm like okay i can try out this bag and see if i love it enough to go ahead and purchase the other colors now i can wait you know for the other colors to eventually go on sale so if they end up going on sale way down the line then i can go ahead and purchase you know all the colors that i ended up liking it's really cute like i said this is not my particular bag i will go ahead and pick out i'm more so a hobo um this type of bag a backpack type of bag things like that so this here is something new to me and i'm glad i did go ahead and get it because i am in love with it i can't wait to you know mess around with my stuff the only thing i'm just a little bummed about is because i can't place my glasses in my bag but i'm sure if i put them in one of those small pouches it can work i don't want to place my glasses in you know this bag without having some type of case on here because these are my ray-bans they're not cheap these were like cheap glasses you know i wouldn't care but like i said because if you see they fit without no case on there and i think i do have like one of them like small like I said, drawstring bags or one of them, like um, this case where you squeeze the top, like a, a coin purse. So if I have that, I'm sure it can fit and I can probably place that in the front and then maybe take out one of those mirrors. I need both because I do have the um, impressions and then I also have my blotterazzi. I do need the blotterazzi. So still see, I, you know what, I can just put this in the back area. So I just fixed that. I just put that in the back area so I do have a little more room for the um, glasses to go in there. Hope you guys, there you go.
Yeah, I am in love with this bag. Now I see why everybody here on YouTube is going crazy. Now I understand, y'all. Look, I understand. We are here. We are here, you guys. Like, I understand why y'all was going crazy over this little bag. This thing is cute. I can't go ahead and purchase the Louis Vuitton, but this one is just as fine. I heard with the Louis Vuitton Pochette Matisse, they had glazing issues. And that bag is, I think it's almost 2000 with tax, I think. That bag to me in my opinion shouldn't have no issues because with that type of money i'm going crazy you know like uh-uh hold up wait a minute why is it glazing like why is this doing this and da -da -da. i was getting ready to go crazy with the fact that it had the little mark in the inside but once i rubbed it it ended up coming off so i'm like i know me you know with glazing issues like nah i need my money back because mm -mm, no man pam i just had to get on here and share this beauty with you guys and i did do the unboxing so i'm gonna leave the unboxing here up at the top in the car just so y'all can go ahead and check it out uh before y'all watch this video or however y'all want to do it so down in the comment section like i said if y'all have this bag let me know if y'all loving it did y'all return it did y'all like it or what like how you using it is it an everyday type of bag is it a work bag or what like and then also let me know the best ways that y'all carry do y'all prefer to carry crossbody over the shoulder like this or what because i don't know if i would carry it like this because if i do it would have to be like on the side of me i don't think you can really get it in the crook of your arm see my hand is not going all the way through so before i end the video i will go ahead and take everything out because like i said i'm going to have to go and redo everything again i'm gonna go ahead and take this off so y'all can see the bag and it's see the bag without it just in case you know it took away from the bag so like i said i'm gonna go ahead and open the bag now I didn't place anything in the two side pockets for or the side pocket here. I'm going to show you again what's in the bag. So I have my lip gloss, lipstick, my lotion, my um, Gucci wallet, my hand sanitizer, my gum, and also my two lip products. And this all here was right here in the middle of the bag. In the front of the bag, I just had my Blatterazzi and a pen that here was right here in the front pocket of the bag in the back part of the bag i had my impressions mirror i had my card case i had another pen i had my snack my fruit snack and like i said my card case here was all the way in the back po uh, pocket here in the back back pocket was my iPhone so like I said I just wanted to show you what fits in the bag how it looks on the body and things like that and all of that you can actually find on their particular website I normally don't share that part of the video if you want to know I'll leave the link for this particular bag and then you can just read you know the information that I missed on this particular bag here in this video if it was anything that I missed Please let me know down in the comment section and you know I got you. Wanted to share this beautiful bag with you guys because like I said now I understand the YouTube hype over this bag. This bag is well worth every penny full price or sale price is to me worth it. I'm ready for the fall to come on and come because it's, it's, it's hot here. It's so hot I, I don't be wanting to do anything like it's so hot. So I think I may pull this bag out probably the beginning of the September because it's really no rush right now. So I like I said I may go ahead and use this bag the beginning of September. And with that being said you guys if you like these types of videos please give this video a big thumbs up because it helps out my channel and also before y'all go please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and also don't forget to click on your notification bell so y'all can be notified each week when I upload my videos and until next time I will talk to you later. Bye.